Follow me to Apex, my friends, ReaperHunter23 here, welcoming you to another Let's Play. This time, it is Let's Play Donkey Kong Country. So, you may have noticed that this is the uh, Game Boy Advanced version, and not the original Super Nintendo version. And that would be because... Yeah, I'm just gonna go with HP. And that would be because, well... I'm more attached to this version. Uh, I'll explain it when we get to the beginning of the level. I guess I'll read this first. Okay, little buddy. As part of your hero training, you've got to stand by. You've got to stand guard tonight over my bananas. I'll relieve you at midnight, so try and stay awake until then. Who who goes there? It's the small one. Seal him inside of this barrel and toss it into the bushes. <laughs> oh, I'm silly. Voices aren't exactly my thing. Donkey Kong's bananas are ours. Aww. DK, er, well, technically DK is. Also Diddy Kong's initials, but Diddy tried. DK, DK, wake up. What'd you do that for? I was having a nice nap. Take a look inside your banana cave. You're in for a big surprise. My bananas and my buddy Diddy. They're gone. The Kremlings will pay. I'll hunt them down through every corner of my island until I have every last banana from my horde back. Alright, let's get up to some jungle hijinks. Alright, so, as I was saying earlier, the reason for the, um, Game Boy Advanced version rather than the Super Nintendo version is because I am more attached to this one. And that would be because this was, like, not the first game I played, but the first one that I got that was, like, mine, if you understand what I mean by that. Like, I got it as a birthday present with a red Game Boy Advance that was one of the clamshell models from my older brother. So, and this was, like, way early in my life, like, before I had played a Legend of Zelda game, and I think possibly before I even played, like, Devil May Cry or Metal Gear Solid. And so... This is a pretty special game to me, and I decided to play the version that I spent the most time with. Here. I'll revisit it as much as I do some of the other games that I have an attachment to, but I still think it's... I'm not much of a platformer guy, except for like the classics, really, like Super Mario World, Mario 3, all of the, all of the early Mario Brothers 2D platformers. Donkey Kong Country, Country 2, I didn't get so much into Country 3, but I did watch Nintendo Capri Sun's Let's Play, and that was stellar. Um, oh, almost there. Um, but yeah. And then of course 3D platformers like Mario 64 and the Crash Bandicoots and stuff, but I'm not much of a modern platformer person. Except for Celeste. Celeste is one of the exceptions. What I played of Super Meat Boy was really good too, but I didn't get super deep into it. So one of the cool things about this version of the game, as opposed to the Super Nintendo version, are the cameras that you can find. There's little collectible things that just add to a little bit of... Just, they just add to a, the fun of doing extra stuff and finding secrets, rather than just extra lives and stuff. There's little cool snapshots of different things. The general rule of- oh wow, I can't believe I just did that. Ow, okay. Focus. The general rule of thumb is if you can kill three of the 
enemies in a row, you'll get a picture of them. Unless they're... Unless they happen to be bigger, like maybe... A, uh, not a clump. Clump was the one that just went by. I forget what the... I think Crusha is the name of the one. Like the one that Diddy tried to apprehend in the beginning there and couldn't. He just laughed at him. Oh. Or like if you uh not that. There's a way to get a picture of him too. But Yeah, there you go. Now I think maybe Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, it's a warp? I don't want a warp. I always thought the music for this thing was actually, I like the warp bridge in general, just the way it looks. It looks cool. I just don't want to do it like that. Because you just skip past most level. I'll get this bonus here real quick. I'll play this level again. I didn't mean to do the warp. I think it was over here. Yeah, there we go. I don't know if I'll get all 52 cameras, but I'll do what I can to get most of the ones that I remember being able to. Alright, so I'll do this level again because that was kind of lame. out on being able to get a secret. I should have... Uh, whatever. I'm sure I might die or something. I wanted to say that there was one over there, but no. Play the level, darn it. It's not a secret. Oh well. Alright, so this is one of the bonus levels that you can do with one of your animal buddies. The basic goal is to, I think, get a thousand of the little things, and then you get one of the cameras as a reward, and for every hundred you get a one-up. There's a uh, multiplier in the back. I should have maybe been trying to jump to that. A little sooner. Or... I think Rambi's the one I have the hardest time getting. Oh, and that would be why. I don't think I'm gonna get it this time. Oh well, I'll have plenty of chances to do this. Get those last couple of things I need for the one up real quick. I guess there really isn't anything there, I'm just silly. Ha! Huh. I made him fall. Now, I want to say that there's a reason that there was a... There it was. Okay. I'm not crazy, I promise. If I jump into a pit, it's because I think there's something there. And probably remember it slightly wrong. Oh. I may not be crazy, but I do just play and suck sometimes.
Oof, I thought I was gonna miss the rope there and get toasted by the uh, armadillo again. Grab that again, because why not? Oh. Um, Donkey Kong, are you okay? Oh, weird. Oh, I missed it that time. <laughs> wow. Alright. Can I get the secret barrel, please? Without incident, I hope? Relatively simple. It's just some ropes with some bananas. Whoop. Oh, that shot me past a lot of the level, too. Gives me the chance to go past the level um, regularly. Can I please quit sucking? This is only level two. I'm getting flashbacks to doing very poorly the entirety of the time I did Crash Bandicoot 2 for the sake of Let's Playing. Like, if I ever buy a capture card, I'm gonna need to, like, do the insane trilogy version as Redemption for that. fairly positive I can throw this at something, I just don't know what. No, I don't think it would be either of those. I might just be crazy. Suck it. Nice of them to give you the end, regardless of whether you take the, uh... Okay. <laughs> oh, I guess you can't. Whatever. It's not a big deal. Wow. You're just jerks with that, huh? Stop spinning if I'm Donkey Kong. I did not mean to do that. Let's have a little chat with Cranky real quick. You seem to be doing quite well. If I had been playing, I would have got here much quicker. Hey, calm down. I did the... I did level two for the sake of presentation. One thing before you leave. To save your progress, simply press start on any world map to bring it up. Just bring up a menu. Then select the save icon. Thank you, Cranky. Reptile Rumble. Oh, 
I don't know if... Oh man. Oh, there we go. Okay, I thought I wasted that. I don't remember if the different colored Kremlings like, count as different pictures to get for getting all of them in a row. Not too sure on that one. Oh, I'm a dumb. One more. Donkey Kong, please cooperate. Oh. That was nice of them. Collect for bananas. That was easy. Thank you. Oh, it just drops you right back here. I just can't keep Diddy alive to save my life. Oh wow, that was, that was some risky business right there. I'm gonna do it again. Oh, no I'm not. <laughs> I thought for sure that I was going to get owned by one of them on the way back there. Like I was just going to get frame hit by one of them. Might be off by a smidge. Oh, kind of like that. Ooh, ooh. Thought my invincibility frames were going to run out there. Just a checkpoint. Boink. Haha. <laughs> Oh, I forgot if you just throw the barrel into the screen, it will, uh... Oops. Well, that was a bit of a waste, but whatever. Oh, especially since I know it was down here. Man. <laughs> there I go, trying to get myself killed. I figured I would have been able to clip up there or something. Anyway. Well, that was embarrassing. Two deaths in like three seconds. The nice thing about this is that while it's very easy to die in this game, they do give you one-ups a plenty. So as long as you don't completely suck, as I seem to be doing right here. There we go, that's better. So as long as you don't completely suck, like I have been doing for the past couple of minutes, oh man, then you shouldn't really have a problem with game overs. They're very generous with the bananas and the... Yeah, the bananas and the um, one-ups, just all sorts of secrets. Oh, if I would have screwed that up, I would have been able to... I would have been able to get a picture of the snakes. Whatever. I'll have more chances. You know, typically I hate water levels, but I think this game, with most of them anyway, pulls, pulls them off quite nicely. There's just something... I think... I don't know, it might just be the music that sells me, because this music is so serene and kind of mysterious. I like it a lot. A little secret banana over here to lead me to some more secret bananas. 